I'm Jason Buffington. I'm a senior analyst in the Enterprise Strategy Group covering data protection. Whenever something goes wrong, really wrong, we hope that Superman will fly in and save the day. When something goes wrong with our computers, we often hope that the IT guy really is Clark Kent in disguise and that he'll throw on his cape at the first sign that the servers go offline or that data is corrupt. Now, when it comes to mid-sized organizations, the IT guy desperately wants to be Clark Kent. But in fact, he really may not even play a superhero on TV. Why? Because most mid-sized organizations aren't able to hire the diverse staff, such as true backup experts or recovery experts, any more than they have career database specialists or virtualization architects or email experts. In reality, there is no Justice League of IT heroes, either day to day or when something breaks, because most mid-sized organizations are maintained by IT generalists, folks whose tireless efforts are needed just to keep things running, usually on a budget that seems unfathomably insufficient. And while that in itself is heroic, often it's not seen as the spandex and cape heroism that folks are looking for during an IT outage. Mid-sized organizations actually need data protection arguably more than anyone else. In recent ESG data on IT spending intentions, mid-sized organizations show that improving backup and recovery was their number one plan priority, and improving business continuity disaster recovery planning was number two. Mid-sized organizations arguably need data protection even more than enterprises. Now, some enterprises actually do have superheroes within their IT, experts that use their superpowers to ensure higher uptime or more agile recoverability in advance with clustering and snapshots and multi-site replication and advanced protection with granular recovery. And when all of that fails and something bad really does happen in IT, there really are phone booths for them to go and put on their capes. Heck, there's a lot of similarities between large corporate IT operation centers and the Batcave. Some of them even have butlers. But if you're the IT hero in a mid-sized organization, you probably just want to bang your head on a brick wall with the challenges of data protection that plague your environment. You have the lack of the resiliency mechanisms that many enterprises boast of. You aren't able to maintain the staff of heroes that you arguably need. And of course, there's that occasional lack of budget, regardless of the requirements that your users ask of you. Instead, while you're down and your users are losing productivity, you're paying someone else to help fix the problem while your organization is actually hemorrhaging cash. And because as a mid-sized organization, some offer what would be perceived as commodity services, there always seems to be the threat that any impact in IT productivity will result in the loss of valued customers. The good news is that mid-sized organizations don't necessarily need enterprise-style heroism if you have enterprise-quality stuff right size. Just because you weren't born on Krypton and you don't have the largest trust fund in Gotham City doesn't mean that you can't be the IT hero that your organization needs you to be. That's right, in Justice League terms, you too can be Green Lantern. What does Green Lantern have? He has willpower and a ring. What should you have? A data protection plan and the right gear. Now let's figure out what should be in that plan. You need to understand what your key systems are have to appreciate how each one of those systems affects what percentage of your user base as well as the dependencies between the systems and the different user groups. Then you can start to define your plan based on what kinds of recovery you need. Instant VM rollback, granular file, distance based, etc. Um, once you understand that, then quantify the cost of not having those recoverabilities and now you can start looking at the technologies and their prices. You see, until you understand what you need, you will almost assuredly be looking at too little or too much data protection. Instead of being Batman, you're a lot more like the Joker. Now, what should be in the gear? First and foremost, recognize that while you may not need the same kind of petabytes this or synchronous that, you almost assuredly need the same kind of agility and scale and flexibility that enterprises need. You just need them right-sized in economics, in form factors, and in capabilities. So what should mid-market sized IT organizations be looking for in modern data protection? Well, first and foremost, don't settle. Just because you may not need the same kind of scale on the upside doesn't mean you don't need those kinds of features. First thing you want to be looking for is easy, and easy means a lot of things. Easy to deploy, well maybe that's an appliance form factor instead of having to roll your own, and that appliance could be physical or virtual. Sure, you could go ahead and build your own solution, but why? 
ESG data recently looked at some data protection modernization trends, and one of the things we clearly saw was instead of rolling your own backup servers, there was a strong preference towards an appliance or a virtualized appliance form factor. Now to add to that, recognize that the virtual appliance that you consider today might grow into needing to be the physical appliance that you use next year, or vice versa. Heck, you might decide to move the whole thing to the cloud by 2015. So the packaging of the solution, self-contained but flexible and movable, becomes notable in that you become future-proofed. Easy means a couple other things as well. Easy to acquire, and again, I'll kind of point you back to that appliance form factor as one desirable alternative. Also, you want to try to reduce your services cost, particularly during deployment. If you want to spend money on services as part of defining the architecture data protection, that's good. Spending money on services just to build something that can be consumed as a pre-built appliance? Why? There's a huge amount of TCO and economic value from comes from purchasing something which is right-sized and well-integrated before you get started. And that's really what mid-sized organizations ought to be looking for. It has to be easy to use, too. Remember, easy does not mean dumbed down. You're still going to need to be able to protect physical servers, even if many of them are hosts, because assuredly some boxes will never get around to being virtualized. And obviously you need to protect virtual environments as well, and that should include both VMware and Hyper-V. And as I mentioned, cloud extensibility, or maybe cloud evolve ability, is a very good future-proofing capability that you ought to be looking for along the way. You ought to be also looking for modern instrumentation, wizards, solutions where some intelligence is built in, and, or otherwise makes you smarter, like dashboarding, so that you can make better decisions. Frankly, the better, or more intuitive and unified that your panes of glass are, the easier that your administration of that will be, and that frees you up to be the hero in some other aspect of your IT world, probably where some other villain is up to no good. As I mentioned, mid-sized organizations arguably need data protection as much, if not more, than enterprises, but it doesn't mean they need the same data protection. You don't need the same kind of gear, which you do want are the same kinds of capabilities at the right scale. You may not have Clark Kent waiting in the wings, but you yourself can be Hal Jordan or Green Lantern. You've got the willpower, that's a data protection plan, and you've got a power ring if you have the right data protection gear. Do that and you'll be the IT hero that you've always read about in those old comics. I am Green Lantern, uh, Jason Buffington from the Enterprise Strategy Group, signing off.